I was really fortunate to grow up in a really playful family. From my early years, I know that my mum was attentive. I've got pictures of her sitting, playing with me on the sofa. I know that she gave me time and attention. And when I was born, my dad was the first to hold me. As a baby, I know I was cuddled, I was held, I was swaddled and kissed and loved. For Christmas, as a toddler, I got this doll and I'll never forget this dolly. It was a bit worn, but it was the best doll in the world. You pressed its tummy and it made a crying noise. I would spend hours running around the house with a doll in the pram, giving it cuddles and putting on plasters. Then came the years of Lego. I loved that stuff. I know my dad always wanted to do it by the instructions, but I liked the idea of creating something that was different and new. I would get the Lego, tip it out onto the floor and leave it there for days. And each day I would add to what I was building. I'll never forget handing the Lego box to my sister. That time that the box moved from under my bed to under hers. Every now and then I would do a little bit of building, but I grew up to love the skate park more. It was daunting, it was scary, it was challenging, but it was a space where I could push my boundaries and try to do something much cooler with my friends. I'll never forget the bright yellow skateboard that I had. It was hard to use, but once I mastered it, I had an amazing time with my friends. Then there were the years at the local bowling alley. You know, the classic hangout where we go bowling with dad. He would take my mates and then after we'd spend silly money on all of the arcade games. It was crazy how many times we played air hockey and challenged each other at the car driving game. All those experiences, the dolls, the Lego, the trampoline, the skate park, all the times out with my mates as a teenager, were all moments of play. And now, as a mum, I keep playing. I follow my child's lead. I'll discover with them what they love to create and build. I'll take them on adventures to skate parks and all kinds of other places, following them into creativity, problem solving, and learning more about themselves. Because let's be honest, play is the most fun thing to do with our children.